Howdy ho, it's Rylino, and welcome to some more Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. I have no clue what we're supposed to be doing, but then I realize I can change the time. That'd be helpful. Now, what does the area map say? Still nothing? Still nothing! Uh, let's change the time to a bit later, then. Something's bound to change eventually. Oh, yep. As a matter of fact. This is my fourth time trying to record this, by the way, because my, my connection kept bugging out. I finally decided to switch which HDMI port is uh, this, this uh, console is plugged into. So hopefully that works. If not, I'm going to scream. Hi there. Tell me what's wrong. Eh? Find someone who can mend the keepsake. Give Dean the broken bracelet. Oh, right! Hi there. I remember this quest now. I need you to fix a pendant that a boy named Rocco broke. Usually I tell people to sort out their own problems, but I suppose he's just a kid. Alright. Ah, thank goodness. Rocco, that name sounds familiar. Isn't he Sonia's little boy? Make sure you say that it was me who fixed it. That's all the things I need. I want the notoriety, damn it. Here you go, little kid. Dean from the lab? This Dean guy must be pretty awesome. When I grow up, I want to be able to fix things just like him. Thank you. Aw, that's wholesome. Glasses, bangle, oh thank goodness. More shit to equip. Oh, that's only her? Oh shit, she wears glasses. Oh hell yeah. And what's the other thing I got? Bangle, right? And she can only equip that. Ooh, I like that. Even though she's wearing next to nothing. E <laughs> that wasn't intentional. Or was it? I have no clue anymore. Uh quest log. Still got several things I need to do. Most of them monster stuff, so... Hmm... Hello? Maybe if I head out there, because I'm in the town right now, it's not going to show me what I need, want to see. Oh yeah, I want to buy stuff, potentially. Because I like outfits. Oh wait, no, this would be smarter, actually. This would be the smarter things to purchase. And as far as... These... Any... Vast improvements across the board, like somewhere. Ooh. Oh, I don't have enough for that. I might have enough for it, though, if I sell some shit. Uh... 
Sell one of those, sell one of those. Yeah, let's get those. Alright. I'm just about broke. Ah, there's no... There's no notable difference. Boo. That's disappointing. <laughs> Uh, this was one between me and, uh, Fiora, right? No. Okay. See if there's any notable changes. Not especially. If there's no changes by the time I get to nighttime, I'll just progress as far as story goes. Oh, wait, no, there are changes. Finally. Why a bunch of jokers? Okay, I'm gonna need you to not be aggroed on me. Thank you. Oh, got the medicinal brog oil. I really need to look into what the difference is between yellow dots and green dots, because they all seem to do the same thing, as far as I know. <laughs> Alright, so what are these? Oh! Oh, these are Tephra... Defeat Lake Magdalena near Outlook Park. Uh, so we want to go there. Tephra Cave, Tephra Cave, Tephra Cave. What is this? Stone Crabbles on Agora Shore. So technically I only have three side quests to do and one of them I'm going to be turning in shortly. Uh, I need to look at the map really quickly. So where the hell is... is it that direction? Tuffer Hill, Cliff Lake, the air battery, it mm, No, it can't be that direction. I don't even know how to get that direction. Alright, you know what? We'll head back to Tranquil S Square, turn up the time to turn in that one mission, and then we will progress with the story. I know, there's a story. Couldn't believe it myself. But I love that there's so much so much side content you can do, so much shit you can get distracted in. Makes it really fun to just explore, you know? Who's there? Who's there? I'm fit as a fiddle again. Huzzah! Got some shoes. Oh yeah, these are different. Okay. I think I'll clip them on on you. Oh 
Oh, this is why I didn't see anything different with the Imperial Girdle. I wasn't even paying attention to that. Shit. Okay, uh, submenu, clear appearance. Ooh! Sorry, I'm just like a total absolute geek when it comes to those details. My god. Okay, uh... So, for future reference, let's see... Current. That helps. That helps tremendously, actually. Um... There's something in Outlook Park. And then there's that, the two stone crabbles. I'll head to Outlook Park and change the time a few times. <laughs> oh, I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Actually, looking at these, do these give me any indication of, like... Macon Wreckage Site. Tefra Cave Entrance. Nah, I still don't know where. The stone crabbles are supposed to be. To be honest, I feel like it's gonna be a nighttime thing. Hmm. Or maybe I'm just a dumbass. spawning otherwise I'd see the exclamation point right okay uh, we're gonna move on with our lives here at the Tefra Cave entrance. Get some shit done! What's that over there, actually? Oh god, I'm already getting distracted. Help me. Never mind, I changed my mind. I want to go down this way. And then he drowns, the end. Oh, god damn it. Oh, I have to come in from another section. I just realized that's what that is. I'm an idiot. For the magical powers of teleportation, Shulk looks so cool with his outfit. Cool blue. There are many types of monster. Ooh, we're finally getting a tutorial again, too. Type of monster is shown in the target window. You can toggle enemy icons on or off in display settings from options via the main menu. Ordinary monsters will not attack unless you attack them. Visual types will attack when they see your character. Yeah, I, I, I spotted that. Luring a monster to an area where there are no other monsters can make for a safer battle. I think I actually have done that before. 
<laughs> try to lure things away. If you are fighting a monster near one or more of the same species, the kindred monster or monsters will join the battle. Lure away individual members of a group to take them down one by one. You can tell a monster's danger level from the color in the target window. Oh, oh, okay. The higher the danger level, the more difficult it is to hit the monster and evade its attacks. Easy, weak, equals strong danger. Okay. So yellow and red I need to be uh, alarmed by, if anything. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Your enemy from a distance. Oh. I think we're okay. There's only... The difficulty levels are... Easy peasy. Probably helps that we did all those side quests earlier. <laughs> I was using the fight to kind of look at the effects of my arts. Ooh. <laughs> you look like such a dork, dude. It's fine, though. As far as arts are concerned, Hammerbeat, Bone Upper, and Wild Down have been upgraded to a new level, so that's good. Just need to graze over these a little bit. Okay. Um. Oh, did you learn new shit? <clears throat> you might have. Engage. Aura that greatly raises aggro drawing enem enemy attention. Okay, so it's basically provoke. Use weapon to block attack. Or that lowers physical damage. I'll put this over here. Put things of a similar color next to each other. It's kind of what I'm going at here. Uh, upgrade stream edge. As far as you go... As far as you go, Ryan. Rain. I'll boost up one of the expensive ones. <laughs> Bone upper. Increases damage, reduces cooldown. Hidden Foreign reduces cooldown, increases damage. Nifty. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your guard. You can drop your guard, it's fine. <laughs> Caravan boots, I saw those. Just barely, I saw them. I'll give you them, because it increases your physical defense. Hello everybody! I'm Rai. Oh wait, they're monsters, they don't understand what the hell I'm saying. Caterpillar nest? Why did you freak out like that, Shulk? You almost gave me a heart attack. Ah, damn. Eh, I'll just kick your guys' ass while I'm here. This 
Just beat the crap out of him. You know, it's kind of jarring looking at the HP. Like, Ra Rain has like 2200 and then Fiora has 800. <laughs> Makes sense though, I guess. Oh, these actually are better. I guess I'll take this off. How do I take it off? <laughs> I'm assuming there's a way to remove it. Oh, there it is. I'm a dumbass. Thank you. Have a nice day. <laughs> There's an exclamation point over yonder. Can I lure it? There we go. Because there's a dude to the left of me. <laughs> Not that strong, but still. Better safe than sorry, I always say. Like this. I'm getting a lot of a lot of those little I'm getting extra equipment pieces is what I'm meaning to say uh, perfect the other ones don't even see me uh, reduce your aggro please thank you There we go. Let's keep going. Man, what a bunch of jokers. Battle armor. Oh, that looks cool. And they look different for each individual character. That is so awesome. I think I'll give it to him, though. He's gonna look like a serious badass. Like, oh my god, I would not want to mess with that guy. Everyone, let's go! Yeah. Oh, are you guys aggroed on me too? You douches. There we go. Oh, they're all aggroed on us. No, oh, well, big deal. <laughs> Money. Reduce my aggro and then take this one down. Oh, shit. Hit swing. Oh. That was like a combo y sort of thing. Cool. Oh, my affinity. Our overall affinity just went up from that. I'm all for that. Oh, here's the Magmel Ruins. Are these the Magmel Ruins? Haven't you been here before? Nope. The Defense Force often uses it for training, but I come here to do research. It's not really a place that people go. Not surprising. There are monsters around here that use Mechon parts as armor. Was this built by the Mechon? I don't think so. There's a path for people to get in. 
It might have been a vehicle of some kind. Like the Defence Force hover transports. A vehicle? But it's so big. It's amazing technology. I wonder what kind of people made it. I ain't got a clue. Let's keep moving. The we didn't ask you, dude. <laughs> right. Eh, as much shit as I give him, though, you know, I do like him. He doesn't annoy me. He just makes my eye twitch when he says or does stupid things, like touching the Monado, because he was he wanted to touch it. Ugh. Take shortcuts using skip travel. Use skip travel to return to landmarks you have previously visited. I've been doing that, dude. Falling icons may be displayed on the area nameless. A red flag is story destination. Red exclamation point is a story quest destination. Blue is an active quest destination. You can return to the shop in the colony. View the lamp map and select the landmark you wish to travel to. It's probably a good idea to return to the colony when your inventory is full so that you can sell some items at the shop for money. Wait, there's such a thing as having my inventory too full? What? How do I look at my inventory? Oh, okay. And is there a way for me to... Like, I don't want to accidentally hit something stupid. Mmm... Game, why were you talking about, like, go back when your inventory is full? I'm not even close to that. <laughs> We are A-OK -okay as far as that's concerned. Ew, I picked up a rat. Like a dead rat. I hope it's dead anyway. Actually, no, that's kind of even more gross in a way. <laughs> How is this? Looks like some sort of pa control panel. What the hell are you doing back there, Fiora? Why are you... What the... Why are you just jumping in place? <laughs> so weird. <laughs> huh? I can't see anything, dude. Was trying to. Oh, this thing is tougher. Oh no, she missed. Well, I guess she did say that. Come on. When carrying out a chain attack, you can select arts for the three members of the party to perform. During a chain attack, any arts that were still in the cooldown phase will be available regardless. Ooh. Deal substantial damage with a chain attack. Using arts of the same color consecutively during a chain attack raises the level of damage or recovery. Decide what type of chain attack to perform based on the circumstances. Talent arts with, will chain with any color, so try out different combos. Use chain link to add to the chain. After the third party member uses their art, chain link may be activated. When this occurs, press B at the right moment and one party member will be able to use an additional art. Increase affinity to power up the chain link. The deeper the affinity between the party members, the easier it is to activate chain link. If you're lucky, you can activate it up to 15 times in a row. God damn. Every time another art is used in the chain attack, there's a chance that chain link will be activated again. Oh. 
They're fine, dude. Oof. We got it. Am I good or am I good? Ooh, that was tough. <laughs> you two never change. We did good there. Let's see. Steady Grease and Crusher. Oh, and these already have gems embedded in them. Alright, let's see. Oh, these are heavy. Nobody can equip these yet because we don't have the skill to equip heavy equipment. Um, what about the Crusher? Not really better, actually. What a... Light Driver is what I have. Yeah, my Light Driver is the highest strength equipment piece I have. Don't really see a point in removing it. Yet, anyway. I want to go towards that mining thing because there's also a heart to heart over there. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your guard. This, this won't take long. It really didn't take long, shit. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your guard. This, this won't take long. I think it won't take long. I've heard that line so many times from me now, Shulk. A goober. How's the quest log looking? Oh, good. Now that I sorted it, so it only shows current uh, current ones. Now it stays like that. Yeah, I'm pretty much good as far as side quests go. We might actually get some forward momentum in this game, which is incredible. Oh, are we going to come out on the northwest side of? Uh, of Colony 9. We are. Cylinder Hangar. Aw, oh, man. We'll go in there in a second. I just want to peek over. Well, at the very least, this confirms that this is not where I'm supposed to go for the Stone Crabbles. I guess I shouldn't have expected it to be, but... Eh. Right here! Thanks for the help, Shulk. I'll start collecting them up. You two hold on a sec. It's full of ether cylinders. Hey, why do we have to come all the way here to get them? Isn't there an ether cylinder fueling station in the colony? Well, refining the ether takes a long time down there, and sometimes cylinderization fails. And there are so many cylinders here for us already, it's more reliable than making them ourselves. Right, and Colony 9's anti-air batteries and mobile artillery are standardized for these cylinders, so they can be used straight away. I see. You know, this place is in good condition considering it's ancient. It might be that there's some form of technology being used to preserve it. It's just a shame we don't understand its secret. Shulk? But I'll solve it one day and show you. If it's just technology that someone created in the past, it's not incomprehensible. We'll come to understand it one day. Don't go trying too hard. We can come and get ether cylinders whenever we need them. Besides, it's a good place for Defense Force training. Yeah, so good that you didn't even want to come here without Shulk to back you up. Anyway, did you collect the cylinders? Yep, all done. Thanks. Just come by yourself from now on. Shh, be quiet.
Uh, the hell? In that case, just leave him to me. Try targeting a different monster by pressing L or R. Might be coming handy when fighting several monsters at once. Issuing commands to the party. Holding this ZR plus up focus attacks. Aim for the monster the leader is targeted. Each player fights independently if I do that. And then I can have them regroup by that. Okay. Two of them. Take them down one at a time. That's it. Sure. Oh. You, you, you. Everyone, let's go. Alright, come on. Just keep taking it. Taking it down. Got it. Oh, these aren't very tough at all. Fiora, are you okay? I'm fine. How about you? I'm all right. Thanks to you and Ryan. What on Bionis were those? I've never seen anything like them. Could they have been Mekon? No. I think they were something left by the civilization that built this vehicle. They didn't seem like Mekon to me. But why did they only show up now? I don't know, but they were probably built to protect this place. They might have been activated in response to something, but I don't think that something could have been us. Please, let's go back. I don't want to be here anymore. Me neither. And we've already got the ether cylinders. Huh? What's going on? Listen, what is that? That sound. What's going on? In the sky. The hell is that? Uh, a mechon? Uh, it's a. This can't be. No way. Oh shit. Mechon. How? And they're being airdropped. Somebody is dropping them on us on the colony. That defense mechanism have responded to the mechon. Let's get back to the colony. Come on. Hey, this siren, it sounds different. Yeah, isn't this siren too? It can't be. You guys might want to find cover one large mechon ten carriers and an unknown number of units emerging from the carriers you idiots why didn't you see this lot until they were right on top of us but sir we thought the mechon had all been wiped out ah! Oi, what's happening respond ah. they're dead dude Batteries one to three. Why aren't my targeting systems online? Don't let a single one into the colony. <laughs> Assemble everyone who can fight. Evacuate the civilians to the shelter. Get a move yes, on. Sir. Fire at will. This is bad. There's too many of them. Three anti-air batteries isn't going to be enough for ten we carriers. Do you think? No, wait. What the? Our weapons don't work on them at all. Okay. Uh, that answers my question. Transformers, robots in disguise. Oh shit. What type of mechon is that? I've never seen one like it. You slackers, fire! Shoot it down! Insanity is trying the same thing over and over, thinking it'll work, but instead you're going to get slice and dice. Uh, 
Oh shit, dude. Alright, uh, first thing I want to do is I noticed that the game voices were a bit soft at various points. Everything else is fine. Can I... Can I jump? I can't, okay. I'm gonna have to run there. Alright. Damn right we're making ways. Making history, dog. Alright, we gotta move. Forget, forget the small fry. We have people to save. Hopefully. Something, so I was I was worried I screwed up my recording. <laughs> Yo! Wait, what are they doing to the people? Are they killing them or are they capturing them? Eating. Is Dumban okay? Fiora, go and check on him. Oh, okay. Heads up, Ryan. If this thing wants to fight, let's give it one. Damn right. Battling Mechon. Inflict Topple before attacking one. Anyone can deal damage to a Mechon if it is suffering Topple. Inflict Break before Topple. Break Arts inflict Break, which are the pink ones. Topple Arts inflict Topple, which are green. Use Turn Strike to inflict Break when controlling Shulk. Hit the enemy with Turn Strike to inflict it with Break. Next, wait for Ryan to inflict Topple using Wild Down. I wish I knew how to like switch party members on the fly. I'm feeling it. Hey. We can definitely do this. Uh, hey, back on. Hey. Let's go. Hey. All right, break. Wait, how do I? I really wish I could switch my team or Dude, I need you to I'm pressing buttons. I'm pressing all the buttons to try and Ah. 
Change target, move camera, select arts. Finally, okay. I'm gonna need to look this up, how to change party members. That slowed me down. Like, on the fly. Because I couldn't get to the menu. It's not that easy. We've disabled it, but only for now. It'll reactivate soon. He's gone, isn't he? Where's Dunban? He's gone. I can't find him anywhere. What? He's out. He's yeah, going for the Monado. Ryan, let's get to the lab. The lab, of course. The Monado's there. Exactly. exactly. The Monado can take out Mekon. And Dunban is probably there. Alright, what I want. Running away is a valid tactic. To flee during battle, highlight the talent icon and use up and down to select the flee icon. I saw that a few times. Not field controls, battle controls. Buff debuff one, check move characters, select arts, camera operations, command allies. Is there not a way to s switch who I'm controlling? Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Alright, where the hell should I be going? This way? I just need to dodge these things. Nope. Just flee. Oh dear god. The guys are going down. Run and I'll kill you myself. What the hell are you? A mech on with a face. Grin at me, will you? Oh damn, went down with a bang. Oh, he's still alive. Even Shit! Get the Colonel, I like him! Oh. I think it just took the colonel down with that was overkill but at least he didn't go out like a bitch like he went out like a boss not that that's really much of a consolation No, the lab. The colonel. The guys. I'm gonna destroy every last one of those damn mechon. Shulk, the entrance. No, we'll never get in there now. Wait. Let me think here. Ryan, Viora, there's still the mobile artillery. Right, if we recharge it with those ether cylinders we collected, we can blast our way in. It's in the residential district. Great. All right, this is it. Time to avenge the Colonel and the boys. Oh, 
so the colonel really is dead. That sucks. Alright, let's move. Oh no. What the? Shulk! More from behind! Ryan! Looks like you and I will have to cut apart through them. Looks like it. Fiora, Ryan and I will open up a path. Then you can run through. You two can't do this by yourselves. I want to fight as well. Get through. We'll be right behind you. But Shulk... A year ago, Dunban and the Defense Force fought hard to protect the colony and all of us Homs. Now it's our turn to repay them. Please, Fiora. Shulk! Ryan! Don't look so worried. We'll just get rid of these ones. Shulk won't get a scratch. Oh yeah, you did promise that. Okay, I believe you. Go now, Fiora! Ryan! Huh? You take care too. Of course! Looks like she trusts me after all. I told you. Oh, this is gonna... This is gonna suck. <laughs> oh god, no. <laughs> uh, do I have anything as far as, like, SP? Not really. I'm getting closer, though, to the secret of life. I'm gonna wanna really look at these... Look over these when I... Can later. What about arts? Can I upgrade any of my arts? I also looked up whether or not I can switch party members during battle. I can't, so. <laughs> but people have said that the AI is actually really, like, reliable, so I'm going to bank on that and just push forward. Alright, let's level up light heal. Um... Let's upgrade Engage, actually. Alright. Alright, we need to break and then topple them, right? Come on! I need you to attack what I'm attacking, dude. Thank you. Reduce my aggro. Alright, there we go. I don't actually remember what his recharge time is on uh, his topple ability. Alright. I broke him. Thank you. Stream edge. Oh, he might not have it ready yet. Wait a moment, wait a moment. Okay. That was too close. Right. Whoa. That was close. Leave it to Ryan. Yes. I'm turning up the heat. That was a close one. You were never cut out for this stuff. You go. I'll take care of things here. You're too out of breath to persuade me. Tell me about it. Oh, boy. Right behind you. Oh. Shit, 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 shit. Done, man? That was definitely the Monado. The Monado. Sorry, I 
kept you waiting. Dumba! Who are you, Solid Snake? The Monado! So this is why you weren't at home. I thought so. He's using his other this arm, his off arm. Ready, lads. That, ex uh, that explains why he can use it. He's using his other arm to ma maneuver the Monado. Uh, and I think he's just a guest party member because I don't have access to anything as far as skill branches or arts. Nice one, Dunban. You didn't waste any time on them mechon. Shulk, where's Fiora? The residential district. We said we'd meet her there. Looks like we'll have to take the long way round. All right. Then we cut through the commercial district. Yes. <sighs> At least we got somebody reliable with us, right? Oh, this is a bit before. Don't hesitate, Fiora. You need to do it. The anti-air, the anti-air armaments. All right. We have our battle plan. We're not going to bother fighting, cause even with Dunban wielding a Monado, it's still. A bit of a tall order to deal with all of these things. By the way, oh wait, I can't check. No, I can check. I wanted to check the thing in the upper left. I forgot what it does again. Uh, it's the. Uh... Sorry, this is a little bit interrupting of momentum. I guess it's better. I okay, party gauge, yeah. Party's morale. I need one block to revive a party member. And there are three blocks. Chain attack. Yeah, okay. I thought that was, that's what it was. I just couldn't... I just wasn't entirely sure. Alright, move, move, move. Any more of the Monado. But I must! I don't have a choice! <laughs> Ryan's right. You can't go on like this. Shulk! Dunban. Hey! <sighs> this time, it's my turn! Shulk! No! It'll kill you! Shulk! <sighs> Is he stopping time? What's happening? No, time's going slow. Oh no! Premonition! What the? All right! I, I remember this from Smash! Wow! Shot's pretty awesome! He is! How could this be? Shulk is using the Monado! What was that? Shulk! More company! Ryan! Right! Ryan! Dunbar! I got your back! Shulk! Do you feel alright? I'm okay. 
but there was something strange. Just now, it was as if I could see into the future. Is this another power of the Monado? See into the future? What are you saying? Uh, are you certain, Shulk? Yes. I see. I remember Dixon saying that the Monado had a hidden power. Could this be it? What? Basically, I know Don't that he. I I just realized that he does have premonition because of Smash, because in in the um, storyline for Smash Ultimate, uh, Shulk reacts to like something that he sees that before it happens. So yeah, that it just kind of clicked for me there. Oh shit, that was awesome. I actually got, I wasn't sure what I was seeing at first. But now I have the Monado, baby. It's like Sora getting the Keyblade. Let's go. Monado arts. Shulk's talent art has changed to activate Monado. Select activate Monado to switch between normal arts and Monado arts. Ooh. Monado arts are particularly effective against Mechon. Fight battles efficiently through judicious use of normal and Monado arts. Monado enchant powers up your allies. Monado buster deals major damage. Okay, buster's on the left, enchant's on the right. Okay. Oh, but these still these still work. I can't activate the Monado yet. Come on, baby. I want to use... I want to use the abilities. There we go. Huh. Oh, I could only use it once and now I have to recharge. This is so epic. Shulk's talent art. Activate Monado. Now my talent art is Activate Monado. It lets me channel the power to Monado into Monado arts. Just like before, the talent gauge refills when I auto-attack. I can use the Monado arts in all kinds of different ways depending on the situation. When I'm up against Mechon, I always start off by using Enchant. That way everyone can do some damage. That's what I like to hear! But don't forget, you need to activate Monado before you can use Enchant! What kind of accent was I trying to go for there? <laughs> Each Monado art consumes the talent gauge differently. It goes down completely if I use- Oh, if I use Buster, but only halfway with Enchant. Buster is one heck of an attack, but you gotta remember it empties the talent gauge. Maybe you should save it for the final blow. That's something I didn't do. Eek. Alright, I'd rather have... Oh, wait, yeah, Buster is on the right. Yeah, kind of like... Regular arts. Oh wait, does... Oh! He has skill branches now, so Dunban could be... can be a party member? Oh, I get why! Because he was wielding the Monado and that's not his actual weapon anymore. It's mine. Got it. I get it now. Uh, Alright, let's take a moment here to kind of sift through his stuff, even though he doesn't have any AP. I want to see what he can do. His main one is Blossom Dance, Unleash the Power Within, Slicing for as long as your focus endures. Enemy individual target does a lot of damage. Talent gauge must be max. Combo attack is successful, successful. final attack is close range. Gale Slash, stab an enemy quickly and deeply, inflict bleed damage. Okay, that has 15 second cooldown. 
Worldly Slash combo lowering physical defense after Gale Slash lowers strength. So, okay. Pulverize the enemy with a precise attack inflicting topple. Deals a devastating kick. Inflicts break if used after Gale Slash. Alright, I want to put that there then. And then I'll put this over here. Because I, I, I'm going to switch between party members as far as the leaders. Uh, like, every now and then throughout the playthrough. Because I want to play every character. Fix your gaze firmly on a single enemy, creating an aura of focus. So lock on, double attack rate. Very high cooldown now, so I'll put it there. And then peerless aura of high spirits cures party of confusing increases strength. Okay, got it. Yeah, I want to switch between party members as I play, because otherwise, <laughs> you know, I'm missing out on some of the experience. Not like EXP, but like game experience. <laughs> Uh, these bastards are in my way. Everyone, let's go! Make it a swift victory! Leave it to Ryan! Aura! Minato, lend us your power! Aura! Alright, enchant! Minato, enchant! Behold the power of the Minato! Now it's right! Yeah! You like that? Right! Awesome! Leave it to Ryan! Nice! Fire cylinder, earth cylinder. I want to try this one more time. Alright. I should probably save. I don't think I've saved since, yeah, the beginning of the segment. Oh, this is chapter two? Okay. Oh, big boy. Big boy in the house. It has a face. That don't mean nothing. That's right. Not when we have the Monado. Boss fight. Don't think it's a laser jump. Drop it. Should be in shadow. We're counting on you. We can definitely do this. This is the Monado's power. Alright, use enchant. Oh, am I not doing any damage either? Why the Monado has no effect. Shoot! Right! Get down! Stay back! I'll take it from here! No! You can't take anymore! God, you guys are trying to be macho! Oh shit, if you're in the freaking house! Get out of here! Run! You are mad! 
No, 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 no! Wait, she got it? But the premonition! No, it's still- Oh, it's still- Oh, it's not over! No! No, no, no! Freaking you bitch, you're going down. Chain attack and break art. Inflicting topple on metal face. More like bitch face. The Monado has no effect on Mechon with faces. You will have to inflict break and topple before you'll be able to do damage. It may be difficult to inflict break on larger monsters, but it's almost always possible in part of a chain attack. Use a chain attack to inflict break. Use enchant. I do chain attack. I. Oh! 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 I'm an idiot! I'm a freaking idiot! I'm a goddamn idiot! I forgot entirely that's its own thing. I'm. I'm so annoyed. Uh, whatever. At least I figured it out. Sure, it's toppled. Timing is everything. Remember that. And it's I'm glad I'm figuring these things out as I go. Like, you know, it's blind when I when I struggle like that, baby. Come on, Shulk, adventure.
What is this thing made of? You bastard running away. No! As you can see, I'm already attached to <laughs> attached to the characters because I'm pissed. Sorry if you can hear me chewing, by the way. I was just trying to get something in my stomach while Fiora. playing. Haven't eaten in half a day. Ah, oh, the breeze feels so good. Yeah. I'd forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Ryan. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so peaceful. You know, Shulk, I hope every day can be like this always. Are they wearing the same equipment that they did back then? Huh. That's a nice touch. Hey. Have you been to see Dunban? Yeah. I just can't do it. You got more guts than me. Not at all. It was him that consoled me. Oh. I guess that's the type of guy he is. Yeah. Even without the Monado, he's the strongest person I know. Shulk, how are you holding up? I'm fine, but... you... I will shed no tears. Huh? A year ago, I felt the same sense of deep loss that I do now. The Battle of Sword Valley. After that battle, many of my friends did not make it home. While I was being brought here on that stretcher, they were all I thought about. <sighs> but I decided I would not cry. Everyone who died in that war had something they wanted to protect. Family, friends, loved ones, their home. So they fought to protect them. And we won. No matter how painful, no matter how hard, it's nothing to be sad about. I decided that there and then. Dumban. Shulk, Fiora would tell you the same thing. <sighs> She wanted to protect us. Or rather, she wanted to protect you. And you're alive now. So, I will not cry. Okay. Remember the gift of life that Fiora gave you, and treasure it. I... I can't say that I understand. But... I hope to. Someday. That is all I ask. Believe me, I'm always just trying to understand. Words to live by. Treasure the gift of life that Fiora gave you. He's one of a kind, that Dunban. I've made a decision. Huh? My purpose in life. I will pursue that faced Mekon. Shulk. They attacked our colony. Killed Fiora. I will find that Mekon. Find it and destroy it. Destroy them all. <laughs> What are you laughing at? Sorry, sorry. It's just a bit weird. I never thought you'd be the one to say it. So you agree? Of course, man. I'm just surprised you came out with it first. You thought I'd try and talk you out of it? Hell That's no. Not what Fiora would want. That sound right? Yeah. Something like that. 
I thought you'd give me a hard time. In my head, there are two versions of me. One of them is saying that. It's telling me, listen to what Dunban said. What about the other one? It keeps shouting, make them pay. Destroy every single one of them. Damn. And it won't stop getting louder. That doesn't sound like you. Sure, it ain't my voice in there. Might be. It's a bit of a loud mouth. There you go, then. <laughs> <laughs> Needed that. Needed that. So, when are we heading off? Right now. Perfect. Where are we going now? Right then. Yeah. Look after yourselves, boys. As soon as this heals, I'll be right behind you. Damn right you will be. Seize our destiny. Together. I can't believe Fiora's dead, though. I can't believe it. Thing is, we were able to level up her abilities, this and that, and the other way, like any other character, so... There was no reason for me to believe that. I thought she was, like, legitimately, like, a permanent party member. But I guess not, because no ifs, ands, or buts about what we saw. She died.